Kansas, carry on my wayward son from 247, two minutes and 47 seconds into the track. <laughs> so you can refer to that. Here it is slowly, however. finger at the uh, fifth string seventh fret so and immediately cut off the sound of that note by resting your pick back on the, the fifth string and then your, your first uh, finger can grab the fifth string at the fifth fret and play that note staccato as well and then you can shift back to the fourth fret with your first finger grab that fifth string fourth fret so, so open seven five four so to the 6th string, 7th fret, you can use your 3rd finger, and that's followed by the 6th string, 5th fret, and 6th string, 3rd fret. And then 5th string, 5th fret, 5th string, 4th fret. And then we have the same thing we started with in the previous phrase, open 7, 5, 4, and then 6th string at the 7th fret. Now, as soon as you play the 6th string, 7th uh, fret, play the, follow that up with the 5th string at the 5th fret. You can use your 1st finger. And then you can use your 1st finger again on the 6th string at the 7th fret. Thank you. 
fret, third finger on the fifth string, seventh fret. If you want, you can add your fourth finger to the uh, fourth string at the seventh fret. You can play it as a two string chord or a three string chord. Rest, and then G5, back two frets, third and fifth frets. And then F5, first and third frets. So. Three notes on the sixth string, open first third, followed by two notes on the fifth string, open and third fret. Use your second finger to grab that third fret, and then you can play A5 right there in the second position. First finger can bar across the fourth and third strings of the second fret. Include the fifth string, open, that's the root. Rest, and then G5. To that right. Move up to uh, the fifth position for D5. We have fifth, fourth, third, fifth. And that's the fifth string, fifth fret, third and fourth string, seventh fret. Fifth string, fourth, third, fifth. Now shift back two frets to the third fret. That's a C5. Same thing again. Fifth, fourth, third, fifth strings. And then shift back two frets. This time you'll play fifth string, fourth string, third string. Followed by that ascending rock. And that's the open fifth string. Uh, the first fret and the third fret of the fifth string. Then two notes on the fourth string, open and second fret. You can grab that with your first finger. And back up to D5. C5. So. placed on the sixth string at the third fret, third finger on the fifth string, fifth fret, and you can add your pinky to or use the bar. I use my fourth finger on the uh, fourth string, fifth fret, so that sixth, fifth, and then you can strum the chord, third, fifth, and fourth strings combined. And let that ring for a couple more beats, and then you're back into the chorus. Which we discussed last day. All right, uh, to be continued.